our job then is to just try and give them some good role models, um, encourage them to have a healthy lifestyle. Um, a lot of these lads are in trouble for fighting, they're aggressive by nature, so give them something positive to, to channel that aggression into. A lot of these lads are, you know, weren't involved in drinking drugs, they'd be the first to say that, you know, leading the wrong lifestyle. Um, the, the key thing for me is that the two don't go together. You can't, you can't be a martial artist and you can't be somebody who's going to be drinking and, and putting the wrong, the wrong types of uh, food and that into your body. So we encourage our lifestyle, we've got a dietitian working with the team. Um, but also they got a lot of role models, the likes of Jack Marshman who were, who were in trouble as youngsters who really turned their lives around and made a career out of the sport, so they got good people to look up to. Good social life as well, we've got a real real team and a togetherness around us, so socially it's great for you, mentally it's good for you, and like I said, a healthy body means you'll usually have a healthy mind. We've been chasing the USC now, for, uh, I, Jack's been ready for probably 24 months, we just been pushing, pushing and pushing the organisation to accept the Welshman into it. So I think where is he's probably opened the door now. We'll have a few kickers through. Um, I think within 18 months we'll have three or four fighters in the UFC.